Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll continue talking about formulas, which is one of the building blocks and the very important things of Excel. And I'm showing this here in Excel 2016, but the principles are the same for previous versions of Excel and most other spreadsheet applications also, actually. So what we did, we had some information here, and then we did a formula that calculated the sum of B2 to B3. So the colon sign here indicates from B2 to B3. If I click inside this formula here, you'll notice that I actually get some highlights here. So the B2 to B3, I can actually, actually expand this by just dragging and dropping if I want to summarize a whole area like that, or a whole range actually. So it's very interactive. And I'm going to talk more about the principles of the formula. One of the benefits of doing it like this, if I enter another number now, it, the number here in the B4, where I have my formula updates automatically. So you never really want to do the bad example that I showed you before with equals 70,000 plus 60,000. That will give you the right answer, but of course, if I change something here, but this of course is not updated if I change that number because now this is what's called hard-coded and you really never want to do that in Excel so I'm going to start by erasing that so that's another important knowledge to have how do I erase stuff in, in Excel in a cell well simply press the del key on your keyboard to delete something there we go and just press enter so that's a bit more about formulas we'll continue in the next demonstration on how to make formulas look different than other cells in your spreadsheet. Thank you for watching.